What is up guys, Zack Scott here playing Pokemon Sword. This is the Isle of Armor DLC. I have an armor pass, so hey, we're gonna play this today. Before we kick off today's episode, I wanna thank you guys so much for your support on this series. Pokemon Sword and Shield ha has been a great series on my channel. Uh, in fact, you left over 47,000 likes on the very first episode, and it now has over 3.6 million views. Thank you so much. That was first published back in 2019. What a year, right? Well, hey, this is the Isle of Armor DLC. You have an armor pass. Show it to the rail staff at Wedgehurst Station if you want to visit the Isle of Armor. You'll be able to set out on new adventure on a new adventure where you can catch rare Pokemon and grow with your team. So, uh, let's do that. I've obtained an armor pass, and so I'm starting off here in this lab here. It's in my key item spot. It's been a while since I played this game, of course. So uh, if I'm a little rusty, you know, with the controls or whatnot, <laughs> don't don't mind me too much. Anyway, Wedgehurst Station. So let's uh, back out of here. Do you guys want to say anything to me before I leave? <laughs> What's up, dude? Hop Z Dog. I'm giving it my best in my studies. It's not easy, but it's still great fun. All right, good for you. And hello, Sonia. If it isn't Z Dog. Hop's been studying pretty hard, surprisingly. I'm sure he'd be glad to know you dropped by. Well, hey, he already knows. I just talked to him before a visit. All right, well, hey, hey. I'm glad, I'm glad, I'm glad that uh, you guys are doing great. Wedgehurst is where we're going, right? Wedgehurst. And so, uh, let's figure out exactly, you know, I don't remember the town's names. <laughs> I could very well be in Wedgehurst right now, I don't even know. Uh, but no, uh, map time, here we go. Let's look at the uh, town. This is the town map, and uh, I am <laughs> I'm in Wedgehurst. Okay, <laughs> knew it. Uh, so we got to go to Wedgehurst Station, and then uh, take a take a trip out of here, right? So let's do that really quick. And Wedgehurst Station is where exactly? Uh, huh? Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> I don't even know. Um, I should know, but I just don't know. I don't remember. But we'll find it. Uh, is it over here? No. <laughs> All right, like I said, it's been a while since I played. It's been a while since I played the game, and now my memory is gone. Uh, it's probably down here. If I don't know where it is, I'm just gonna redo this intro. <laughs> if I can't figure it out, is this what your station was? <laughs> All right, we'll, we'll figure it out. It's probably down here. It is probably down here, right? Uh, there it is. Okay, this is it, right? All right, so I gotta take it to the Isle of Armor. Probably. It's loading in right now. The train to the Isle of Armor has arrived just in time. There we go. And, oh, who's that cutie? Those with an armor pass, please board the train. All right. Sup, sup, guys. Do you have an armor pass? Hee <laughs> hee, of course. I totally have one. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to do her voice. All right, please allow me to check your pass. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Hello. Slow. Oh, a slow poke. Uh-oh, looks like another one's gotten on the train and ridden over from the Isle of Armor. So guys, the Isle of Armor is gonna have a bunch of new Pokemon, by the way. So what's up? Is this is this the first time you've seen a Galarian slow poke? I mean, in this game, <laughs> the coloring of the, no, yeah, yeah. The coloring of the top of its head is curry-like. Isn't it super duper cute? Sure, I guess so. All right, I have a feeling she's gonna be an important character. I don't know, I'm, I keep talking to her anyway. Uh, don't sit down, I guess I, I'm ready to go. I have a ticket. There's a lot of Slowpoke living on the Isle of Armor. Not sure if they feel like traveling or what, but sometimes a few board the train. All right, can I just get on the train? Which station would you like to go to? Uh, how do I get to the Isle of Armor? Uh, maybe I need to talk to the guy in the front. Maybe that, that was the guy. You're the greatest champion, the one who managed to defeat the undefeatable Leon. That's me. Congratulations on your victory, and thank you for visiting our little shop. And with that said, welcome, champion. Here to do a spot of shopping? No. Where? What? How do I get to the Isle of Armor? What is this? Uh, how, what? Hey. Okay, great. Understood. All right. Do I need to talk to the Slowpoke? Slow? He is very slow. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? If, if Slowpoke blocks the ticket gate, it'll cause trouble for other customers. Slowpoke are actually pretty heavy, so do you think you could catch it for me? Yeah, sure. Slow. Yeah, battle Slowpoke in order to catch it? Why not? Let's do that. Slow? Alright, let's, let's catch the Slowpoke. 
The wild slowpoke. All right. Z Dog 2's coming out. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. And I have the Intrepid Sword, so I'm starting off strong. I mean, this better be a strong slowpoke. No, Z Dog's injured. Oh, hold up. Uh, let's just go ahead and uh, let's try to just catch him right off the bat. Can I just use like a regular Pokeball to catch this guy? Here we go. Get in there. Maybe he'll be caught. Maybe he won't. I'm afraid if I hit him with my Pokemon, he's just going to faint. Oh, he's out. Oh, man. Okay. Well, he's going to yawn. Is that, is that going to be effective? I'm drowsy. Uh, let's... I mean, let me just heal this guy really quick. I didn't know I left him injured after last game. I thought he would already be healed. Uh, I may not have a lot of medicine on me. Uh, let's see. Max potion? Sure. You know what? I probably don't even need to heal him. I'm, I'm probably going to get healed soon. We got a lure ball. Uh, love ball, quick ball, luxury ball, great ball, moon ball, die ball, dream ball. What do I do? How do I, how do I catch this guy without... Here, let's just do something a little bit better then. Um, dude, how do I... Level ball. Quick ball. Let's use a, use a great ball. Maybe we'll catch him. I mean, I'm pretty sure like if I if I touch him at all, he's gonna faint. It may not let him faint though. You know what? What I'm you know I, I could probably just oh, I'm asleep. Great. <laughs> Great. All right, let's switch Pokemon. Fine. F Dog's coming out. He's uh he's gonna, I don't know why this part's taking me so long. I bet you he won't faint. So I bet you I can just attack him and he'll be fine. Then I can catch him. Don't put me to sleep. You gotta be joking, kidding me. If you put my whole team to sleep, I'm gonna be mad and drowsy. Let's just fight really quick before anything else happens. Brick break. Here we go. Okay, no, not very effective, but he fainted. Okay, he fainted. So. <laughs> well, he wanted me to catch it, but I fought it instead. Okay. Slow? Huh, Slowpoke still hasn't stopped blocking the ticket gate. Yeah, I know. Looks like defeating. Yeah, I know. I wanted to catch him. I really did. Oh my gosh. Uh, I mean, I do have some weak Pokemon I can bring out, but let me. Uh, here, let me just let me just try again. I don't know. This should work. <laughs> this should just work. All right, come on, come on, Slowpoke. Zidok Two's here. Is he still asleep? Okay, Intrepid Man. Okay. All right, here we go. I know, I know. Uh, great balls, ultra balls. Hey, let's use an ultra ball. Maybe we can just catch him with an ultra ball. Come on, stay in there, please. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's fine. We gained a tiny sliver of experience points. All right, so it did, no, no nickname for you. You're just gonna go, you're just gonna go to my box. Let's see his summary though. There we go. Looking pretty cool. Does he have a story? Hardy by nature. All right, so anyway, I'm just gonna put him up. Put him in my box. All right, we're fine. Let's move on. Thanks much. Slowpoke can be a big trouble to move sometimes. Wow, amazing. The way you caught that Slowpoke was the absolute coolest. Yeah, it was totally cool. First I made him faint and then I caught him. We apologize for the wait. Uh, we have checked your armor pass. All aboard the train to the Isle of Armor. Mind your step when boarding. Please be aware that there will be a connection along the way. Okay. <laughs> I'm headed to a place called the Isle of Armor. I'm gonna catch some rare Pokemon and do some training. Let's hang if we meet up again, okay? Bye-bye then, see ya. Well, let's just hang out on the train. Why don't we sit next to each other on the train? We can chat. Is that a phone? <laughs> what was that? The screen's black right now. Let me on. What? How do, wait, am I, am I to the, this is the same place I was. How do I get on the Isle of Armor? Oh, that's an armor pass. With that pass, okay, I, that's what I wanna do. Where would you like to go today? Oh, he was talking to her. Armor station then. He was talking to her, saying that he's checked her pass. Okay, got it. So here we go. We're going over here, I guess. What is this? Oh boy. 
Okay. I didn't know there was a whole other island over here, but there is the Isle of Armor. All right. Good news. Good news indeed. Now, are these Pokemon going to be weak or strong or what? Like, oh, wow. Look at this. That's a cool cutscene. So I took a train to a car, and then the bird picked me up. Is this your first visit to the Isle of Armor? I'm researching Pokemon biology here on this island. You want to register the Pokemon you catch on this island to your Pokedex, right? I'll update your uh, I'll update your Pokedex so you can do just that. All right, great. Your Pokedex is being updated. The Isle of Armor Pokedex P Pokedex has been added to your Pokedex. All right, I you know I haven't even filled up my regular Pokedex. I'm not really into the completion factor of Pokemon style games. I'm more in it for like the story and the progression and building my own party. But we'll see. When you caught a lot of Pokemon on the Isle of Armor, come back and show me your Pokedex. Well, I'm <laughs> okay. Who's this dude? I'm surprised to, I'm, su I'm supposed to join the dojo on this island today, but there's a strange person standing outside the station. I'm a bit scared to head, head out. Uh-oh. He ran. She ain't too strange. Aha, there you are. Right on time, too. You're, you're pretty punctual for a kid. Hmm, hey, have we met before or something? No, I, it doesn't really matter, I guess. Hello, I'm Clara. I've been at the dojo a while, so they sent me to help out the newbie. What dojo? Oh, come on. I know you're the new student who's supposed to join the master dojo. No, that can't be me. I'm like the champion. What's going on? Am I being mocked by a kid? But I'm the colorful, caring, and charismatic Clara. Well, then, how about we have a quick battle? Just so, you know, we can see who's better. I'll be waiting outside, so come on out when you're ready. All right. Can I get a... He'll never know what hit him. I don't know, man. My Pokemon are pretty strong. What's up? Welcome, champion. Here to do a spot of shopping. Yeah, let's let's do a spot of shopping. Uh, I have... Uh, let's fill up... I mean, I have a lot of money. Let's fill up on Pokeballs. I mean, I don't even really want Pokeballs. No, let's do Great Balls, at least. Or Ultra Balls, even. I have 26. I'm fine. Maybe, maybe I will get some more Ultra Balls, though. Let's get uh, another... Let's get 10 Ultra Balls. That sounds good to me. And I got one Premier Ball in the house. Let's get some more uh, Max and Hyper Potions, probably. Let's get uh, at least seven more. There we go. Uh, do we need any more Hyper Potions? I think we're good. Uh, we don't have any... Repel, Poke Doll, Poke Ball. Yeah, so we're, we're back. We're back. Okay. I'm fine. I'm good. Do come again. Uh, let me go ahead and heal my... My dude here. This guy, he's like asleep, and he's Z Dog too. Come on, let me, uh, let me just. Here's what I'll do. I'll swap him out. I'll just swap out the order of my Pokemon. That's what I'll do. Uh, let's go to Pokemon. Uh, let's have. I mean, he's so strong. Let's have. Uh, I mean, D Dog's the weakest. Let's uh, swap Pokemon. Maybe he can stand to level up some. I don't know. And frankly, I mean, I'm happy with my party, but if we're gonna be catching a lot of new Pokemon, maybe my party could stand to be adjusted some. Here we go. It's a big area. Holy cow. Oh, this is like another, okay, I get what's going on. All right. All right, all right. Uh, right, let's see. Hee hee, I bet this is your first time on the Isle of Armor. Hee hee indeed, uh, let's see. I'm looking at a Pokemon chart really quick. So, it, it is, first up, it is my first time on the Isle, Isle of Armor. I bet you can't wait to start exploring, but first things first, we need to make sure you're ready. Since I've already been at the Master Dojo for a little while now, <laughs> I'll be the one testing you out. Go easy on me, okay? All right, we'll go easy on her. She needs to go easy on me, maybe, I don't know. Your challenge my Pokemon trainer, Clara, Clara, sorry. And Vinipede, okay. So we're gonna be seeing some new Pokemon. Here. And again, I don't know if I'm gonna catch them all. But uh Vinipede, okay, remember it's just a test, so take it easy. I'll be nice and gentle as I knock you out flat. Alright. Uh no, hers are pretty powerful. Uh so if we take a look, uh right now, let me just I, I should have done this before, but Vinipede, uh in terms of Pokemon, is a um is a bug poison type. And so if we're looking at bug poison, uh it's gonna be weak to fire uh Flying, yeah, fire and flying. 
Uh, not ground though, because the bucket psychic, fire flying psychic. Uh, rock. Yeah, so all the stuff I don't have right now. Anyway, let's just. Uh, here we go. Oh, do I have a rock? Here we go. Go easy, yeah, right. This is how D Dog goes easy. Boom! Super effective. Vinipede fainted. Good on you. All right. D Dog leveled up. That's fantastic. Uh, slow poke. So slow poke is actually going to be coming out now. So slow poke. If we just kind of look at what slow poke is all about, this is going to be a. Uh, the, well, the Galarian slow poke is psychic. So uh, a psychic is going to be weak to bug. Ghost and Dark, so I have Dark already. Uh, so, I did not mean to swap, I meant to stay here. All right, here we go. How am I the one getting backed into a corner? This should not be a thing. Okay, but it is a thing, so that's the thing. Is that, this is a thing. All right, and so we got some Dark moves. Oh, we don't have Dark, no, I do have Dark, Never mind. Uh, let's do, let me look at the move info really quick. Oh yeah, this is a good one, here we go. Lock jaw. Here we go. Jaw lock. Boom! No, he's still he's still alive. Super effective. Neither of us can run away. We, we didn't want to run away. Confusion. I hope that doesn't hurt me too much. Look, the first damage you took on the Isle of Armor. Consider it a little gift from me. All right, all right. Come on. Let's uh, let's just fight again. Then I'll use a uh, bite. Super effective bite. Here we go. Chomp. Boom. Slow poke. Take that. Super effective as well. That's what I like to see. So, oh boy. Okay, Pokemon trainer Clara has been defeated. Oh, my next Pokemon is gonna make short work of. Huh? That was my last one. That was indeed the last one. So, uh, huh? No, 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 no. There must be some mistake. Not good. Not good at all, man. How this kid get so strong? I don't know, man. How did I get so strong? Uh, let's see. How did I get so strong? Here we go. If this kid joins the dojo, nobody's gonna pay attention to my strength. I could just tell him to buzz off. No, they asked me to bring in the new st the new student. All right. I'm the new student. Ahem. Hey, that wasn't bad. I mean, it's not like I was going all out. Not at uh, not at all. But still. But you see, our dojo is one that's got a long-standing reputation. Even the famous champion Leon trained at our place. Is that true? Is that true? You're just trying to try to talk me into it. No offense, but maybe, just maybe, you're not quite good enough to make it. So how about this? Why not enjoy the sights? But just stay away from the master dojo over there, okay? Are you sure? Hey, here, I'll even give you this, you know, as a souvenir. A style card, all right. It's a new style card, a card that increases the selection in boutiques and hair salons. Just show it when you visit a boutique or hair salon and they'll let you buy stuff that's not available to most people. Anyway, all right, I guess that's that. See you never, hee hee hee. Yeah, we'll, we'll see each other again. So, this is a brand new place. Big place, by the way. I'm gonna check out, I mean, this seems like the way to not go, so I'm gonna go over here. There's uh, slow pokes all around. I just want to see if I'm, you know, if there's anything over here. I don't really want slowpokes. I, I've already caught him. I don't, you know. Oh, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa! What? What is that? Okay, that's the wrong button. That's what that is. Max revive over there. Good. And there's a tree. So there's all gonna be all sorts of Pokemon here. Now the question's gonna always be is like, you know, gonna revive. Okay, great. Whoa, whoa! Jeez, don't scare me. I don't really, you know. When it comes to catching Pokemon, I mean, I do like catching Pokemon, don't get me wrong, but my primary goal is always to uh, just kind of get through the main story and whatnot. Look at that giant thing out there, holy cow. So let's head out and see what's what. I don't know, you know, we could do some dungeon fights or whatever uh, if we wanted to. Now these are flashing, but that doesn't mean there's... Is there something in them? If they're flashing or is it if they're shining up in the air? Let's see, what's up with this? A bit of energy trickling out of the den. Okay, got 200 W, nice. And so that would be the same story over here. Oh, I ran into something. Oh, it's just, okay, a wild Jigglypuff. Can I just run? How strong are these though? That's what I gotta wonder. 
Level 60, run. Can I run? I got away safely. You know, I didn't see the need to fight him yet, but let's get some 200 W. Whatever the W, I don't even remember what that stands for, but hey. Whoa, noises, noises. All right, and then there's this girl over here. Let's see what she's about. What's you about? Oh my gosh, I saw the most awesome Pokemon ever. I can show you its awesome Pokedex entry for just, okay, sure. Have a look then, feast your eyes on its awesome splendor. So, okay, Abra, okay. Cool. Is that not completely, totally awesome? You'll find different Pokemon depending on the weather, so make sure you search every day. Now again, I'm not gonna be going for completion of the Pokedex, probably not. I'm just gonna say probably not. I'll, I'm not gonna say never say never, you know, that's what they say, they say never say never, but, so I'm not gonna say, ne I'm not gonna say always either. <laughs> what am I saying? I don't even know what I'm saying. That's the, that's the beauty of it. Let's go ahead and just get these Ws. Yeah, nothing in that den anymore, so. Yeah, I see you hopping around. I see you hopping around. I'm just here for the energy. I got energy. Got a lot of energy. All right. Uh, that's not good. So we're almost there. Uh, did 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 did. All right, Diglett. <laughs> oh, Diglett, you're here. All right. Haha, <laughs> you little rascal. I was worried about you. Dig. Thank you for finding my Diglett. Is that a Diglett? This is a Diglett from the Alola region. It's a regional form. That means it has a different appearance because it's from a different region. When I traveled to Alola, I fell in love with these adorable three hairs. I caught a lot of Diglett there and came back. But they went somewhere when I looked away for a second. Diggly! Anyway, you found a Diglett buried in the ground. You definitely have a talent for finding Diglett. If it's okay, you will find all the other Diglett too, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. What kind of... Oh, what, what a kind person you are. Words can express how grateful I am. All right. You found one Diglett so far, so please find 150 more Diglett. If you find them, please tell them to come back to me. I thought 150 more. Yeah, okay. How about no? How about I change my mind suddenly, and we're not going to be finding 105? I mean, I don't know. Again, never say never, but I'm probably never going to find 150 Diglets. <laughs> I don't know. It just depends. Like, I didn't do a completion run on, you know, the original Pokemon Sword. I just did through the story. You know, we'll see how it goes. I found a Sunstone, though. That's pretty cool. And then, uh, let's just walk over here. It's a giant whale out there. So we are approaching this dojo. That's fine by me. I don't know what kind of dojo it is. Oh, there's one of those guys. Now again, the question is like, do I actually want to catch him now? Maybe, maybe not. Whoa. Uh, okay. All right, back off. Back off everybody. Clouds are coming in. Great ball. What? Uh, G Galar Galarica twig. A twig from a species of tree called Galarica that grows in certain areas around the Galar region. It's a material for an accessory for certain Pokemon. All right. All right. Let's get out of here. Now, I don't know. If you guys want me to catch certain Pokemon, let me know in the comments below. For now, though. Here, what's up? Sup? You seem to have an awesome bike. Let me customize it if you like. I'm a bike lady. I love bikes and bike maintenance. Do you want me to customize your bike with the design I came up with? Yes. Which design would you like to choose? Sparkling white? <laughs> okay, I didn't even mean to. I'll polish your bike so it'll shine with sparkling white light. Okay, hold on a second. I forgot how to, I even had a bike. Okay, enjoy your ride. Oh, also, your rotor bike is now sparkling white and it, it also has something about max speed. How do I get out my bike? How do, how do I... I don't, whoa! I don't remember how to get on my bike. Dude, how do I, how do I get on my bike? <laughs> I, I don't remember how to get on my bike. All right, forget it. I don't need to know. But it should be so easy. How do I get on my bike? How do I ride my bike? I don't remember. Honestly, I don't. Do I need more mystery gifts? Give me a mystery gift. 
<laughs> I don't even know if I have one left. Just out of curiosity, though. Give me a gift. Clothing gift. Okay, sure. Boom. Thank you. Sport cap and pattern tights. Okay. Cool. How do I ride my bike? Dude, I don't I do not remember how to ride my bike. Am I just like too close? Man, okay. Let's see. Bag, Pokédex, how do I... Berries, other items, this is my bike here. Hmm. <laughs> the key items. Surely my bike would be in here, right? I got a fishing rod. Sonya's book, I'm a Rotom bike. Yeah, how do I ride this? You can't ride it. Of course you can't, but how do you do it then? Oh my gosh. Get out of here. No, I wasn't whistling at you guys. Dude, there's not, it's, it's not possible. I'm hitting every button. Wait, am I though? Oh my gosh, it's the start button. There we go. It's my new bike, guys. It's my new bike. It's the start, but it's like the, the plus button. Okay. I do feel dumb, but, you know, that's usual. What kind of gym is this? Oh, fiddlesticks. So our new student decided to go back home? Seems that way. Yep, I did my best to welcome him, but he just suddenly left after our battle. And I've been hoping we get to welcome a new member to our little family here, too. Uh, well, hello, and you are, and who are you, love? Huh? Ah! <laughs> of course, you must be the new student that's supposed to join the dojo today. I guess. Uh, sure? Right, 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 exactly, ma'am. I swear, he must have changed his mind about joining the dojo. Oh, but here you are. I'm so happy you decided to come after all. Oh, everything's just coming up roses. Now, I'm quite sure they already told me your name, but it's Z-Dog... That's right, you're Z-Dog, of course you are, love. Though I, I, I'm i rather sure that's not the name I was told before. My name's Honey. I, <laughs> I help keep this place running. And you uh, you can consider me the lady of the house. Not not that the Master Dojo is just any old house. Ugh, why, how? What does he think he's doing just showing up like that? This ain't good. Miss Honey will know that I lied. Seems you already met our Clara. Bit of an odd ducklet, <laughs> but she's one of our own. She's trained hard here at the dojo so she can become a gym leader someday. I can trust the two of you to get along, right? Hehe, <laughs> I'm sure we'll be best friends. Oh dear, but look at me. Here I am making you stand around outside after you come all this way. Come in, come in. Don't mind the faint stench of sweat. <laughs> Clara, get away. You smell like sweat. <laughs> Listen, you. If you dare tell Miss Honey about what happened at the station, I'll melt you down to size, you understand? All right. I like a girl who can melt me down to size. <laughs> Whoa, what's up there? Hello. Or, wait, oh. I don't see him anymore. But I did see him. All right, so, uh, let me just take a gander over here. I know, just to get, no, nope, wrong button. Nugget, I found a nugget. Oh my gosh, I hear something. I'm just trying to grab some items. I got a focus blast. Excellent. All right, awesome. Nobody get close to me. All right, so let's head into the dojo and find out what this is all about. And do not mind the, the stench of girl sweat all around. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, it's not just girls. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was. Anyway. Everybody, I have an announcement to make. We've got a new student joining us today. Please welcome Z-Dog. I'm sure you'll all have lots to teach him. Hiya, welcome to the dojo. All our students are so good and hardworking. Everyone really gives it their all around here. All right. Now here's someone who's not listed in my database of students. Hello, sweetie pie. It's not 
usual for you to bother greeting a newcomer. This is Hyde, my darling only son. Are you some kind of outlier? Here, you should give this a try. Give what a try? An experience charm. Okay, great. What, is, what does that do? A charm that increases the experience points. Of, yes, perfect. A machine-like object that is inside the charm. But don't open it, okay? It's got tech I developed inside. I don't want you to go and ruin it. He's so good with his hands, always making something new. He's such a clever boy. And that handsome gent in the back is my darling hubby and the very master of the Master Dojo. All right. Hello. It's Mustard. Why, hello there. My name is Mustard. I'm rather good at Pokemon battles, you know. I'm pleased that it's cheese that you could join us. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Such a polite student. You seem to be a hard-working type, too. Don't let him fool you into thinking he's just a silly old man. He's a real beast when he gets serious. Well, darling, I'll leave the rest up to you. It looks like uh, he married quite young. <laughs> Yay, this is my favorite part. I want to see just how good you are. So, why not have a battle with little old me? Just say the word when you're ready. All right, little old him. Uh, how are you guys doing? I got an experience charm from Hyde, too. Just keep it in your bag, and it'll boost the experience points your Pokemon earn. Okay, great. But he was saying don't open it. I kind of want to open it, but I don't think I don't. I don't know if I can. Let's see if I can see the. Uh, there's an armor pass, which is uh, what I use to get your catching charm. High tech earbuds. Where is this so-called experience charm? Moon ball. Okay. These are all berries that I've seen before. I mean, I haven't. They, they, I guess these exclamation points have been here for like the whole time, right? There we go. I guess I'll just kind of scroll up until they're all clear and then that way I, I know that you know focus blast phantom force large leak punch and root key items experience charm a charm that increases now here let's see c confirm what happens if I you seem to hear the professor's voice echoing in your head Z dog dear this isn't the time to use that oh boy I'm gonna have to use that at some point in the future all right, uh, everyone doing great. Hey, my new best friend is, if there's anything you want to know about the dojo, don't hesitate to ask somebody else. <laughs> All right, well, let's uh, let's see. Let's see here, hello. Yahoo, are you ready for a battle? Uh, sure. No one's been resting at my Pokemon, though. I don't know what kind of Pokemon he has. All right, let's get this show started. This is the best way to get to know the new students. I guess so. Hello. You are challenged by Dojo Master Mustard. All right, good. Dojo Master Mustard sent out Mian Fu. All right. It's, I would guess it's a fighting type, but I'm not sure. Uh, so let's just kind of look. Yippee. Oh, I just can't wait to see you battle your heart out. All right, great. So, man, these are pretty powerful. I mean, but this is this is my weakest character, D-Dog. And so, uh, let's see. Mian Fu is uh, a fighting type, as I guessed. And fighting types are weak against flying and psychic moves. Uh, I just don't want to use bug, rock, or dark, which is a lot of what I have. But I have some water that'll just probably work out, okay? Uh, let's just uh, hit him with that really quick. Liquidation. Boom! That was pretty powerful. And he's going to use force palm, which will uh, hit me in the face. Super effective. Uh, he's got two. Let's do another liquidation. That was pretty good. Here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Gotcha. Fainted. What's next? What are you sending out next time? Okay, we gain experience points. So we gained a lot of levels. Our dog grew to 73. Uh, Shinx. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but let's find out. All right, here we go. Uh, do I want to switch Pokemon? I don't know. Shinx is an electric, it turns out. And electric is weak to, a, to ground, and that's about it. But, you know, water, you know, me being a water type... I think, am I weak to electric? Yes, so I don't, I do want to switch Pokemon. Huh? So ground, uh, do I have anyone with a ground move set? I don't know, I don't think so. Uh, so I just, you know, flying's not good, water's not good, you know, uh, so I don't want to be anyone who, who has, is flying or water, but fire should be good, and you know, we can we can let Sea Dog like really, 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 I mean, he's level 66, that's pretty, let's bring out Sea Dog. Sure, let's just do like a regular old, fire move, right? Burning him. Alright, Sea Dog. Here we go. Oh, looks like my little old self's been cornered. I'm getting the shivers. Alright. How strong is Shinx? 61? 
All right, he's intimidate. What are they sending out at me? Here we go, my attack fell. Let's fight uh, with the... Which one's the strongest? I forget. Oh yeah, 150. Oh, but I can't move next turn. This should be good, but let's just do this 120 then. Here we go. Pyro ball. Is this the one I kick? I like this one. Boom. Got him. All right, this guy is just, uh, he's, he's, he's messing with me. He's gotta be messing with me. All right, so, gained experience points. No one else leveled up though, but Mustard has been defeated for now. That was everything I hoped for and more. All right, he's just testing me. I don't know what his deal is, but he's just messing with me, testing me. But haha, -ha, I lost. You're pretty strong, aren't you? I guess. Hey, the newbie won. Master wasn't going all out, but that's still pretty impressive. Who is that kid anyway? I'm Z Dog, the champion. Hello of the uh, whatever region. The way you battle really shows me how much you care about your Pokemon. Even if you come because of a misunderstanding, as long as you have the will to learn, then you're welcome at the Master JoJo. He knows I'm not supposed to be here. I think we can all help each other become stronger. I'm happy you've come to join us. So on that note, here's your JoJo uniform. All right, great. Do I gotta wear it? I got a JoJo uniform. Good for me. I'm now a member of the Master Dojo. Heck yes. Looking good. With that on, you'll fit right in with the students of my Master Dojo. Hey, newbie. If you want to change or just take a break, use that room over there. All right, there's a changing room. Now then. With Z-Dog here now, the Dojo's at max capacity. It's time to really start our training. You'll all be facing three trials. Three trials? <laughs> Wait, why is there a max capacity for this dojo? And there's more. The person who completes the three trials will receive the secret armor of the, this dojo. Ooh, a secret set of armor, I want it. <laughs> that's the spirit. Now let me explain the first trial. Ah, but master, you haven't given me my uniform yet. Why does this kid get a uniform but not me? It's not fair. Oh dear, do you really not have a uniform? My bad, my bad. That's easy to fix though. I'll have another uniform right here for you. I have another uniform right here for you, Clara. Hee <laughs> hee, the squeaky wheel gets the grease. All right. I always said it gets the lube. Clint. Whoa, but what the heck just happened? Poke, what happened? What was that? What is gone? Where'd my dojo uniform go? Po, 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 what, huh? Poke, what, that speed. Was it really the slow poke? I never seen any slow poke move so fast. Hey, give it back. Give me my dojo uniform. Slow, slow. Was it them? Pokey, they're running now, but not as fast as they were. Hey, get back here. Oops, guess I let them out of their Pokeballs a little too soon. <laughs> Master, what's up with those slow poke? The, this is the first trial, my students. You've got to chase after those fast slow poke, trained with care by little old me. But that's not all, you need to defeat them too. And while you're at it, could you get Clara's dojo uniform back? Aw, uh, do we have to? Well, that's that. Do your best, you lot. All right, well, <laughs> that's that, apparently. All right, so. Huh. Everyone's stunned. Like, what? We don't want to do that? Or do we? Well, I'm in my dojo. I mean, in my, I'm in my dojo un uniform now. So, do you want to change back into your usual clothes? Nah, let's keep it on for now. Nah, no need to change. Time to chase down those fast slowpoke. What's up? Through these doors is the battle court, sacred ground for battle and for valor. Entering for any reason other than battle is strictly forbidden. I was wanting to take a nap on the field. What's you, what's you all about? Slowpoke are usually super zoned out, but that didn't stop the master from raising them to be super fast. I know you might be feeling nervous being new here and all, but don't you worry, all of our students are good through and through. They'll take care of you. I don't know about that Clara though. And then what's going on in here? Huh, perfect. Now it's sure to work. I like hide here, making robots. All that's left is to fire it up with the on button. So here we go, let's push it. What is this actually gonna do? Curve. Uh-oh. Cripes, it powered down. Must still need more watts. How many more watts do you need? I got some watts, right? That's what they're called, right? So, does my experience charm seem to be working as intended? I guess so. How do I give you more watts? What is this thing? Some sort of machine made out of junk parts that look like a Pokemon? You like it? Yes. Heh. <laughs> I thought you might be the type. 
That's my cramomatic, and just to be clear, it's the invention of the century. It's my very own brilliant take on recycling. Though it doesn't do a thing right now since since it's out of power. If I just had enough watts, but mummy won't give me any more of hers. How many more do you need, dude? I got some watts. How many more watts? Okay, 500 watts. Yeah, I got those. I can give that. 500 watts. Well, seriously? You'll give me the 500 watts I need? Indeed. It'd take me ages outdoors to collect 500 watts, and the outdoors and me, well, let's just say our systems aren't compatible. <laughs> you just go to like three sites. Okay, anyway. But you. Sorry, what was your name again? Z Dog? I guess you're more the outdoors type, huh? I'll feed those watts you get you gave me into the Cramomatic at once and power on. Cram. <laughs> Just perfect. <laughs> put in four items you don't need and you'll get one new item in exchange. If you put in four of the apricorns that grow here on the Isle of Armor, then you might get a rare Pokeball if you're real lucky. Since you gave me the watts and all, feel free to use my Cramomatic as much as you like. Alright, so let's just see here. Uh, what would you like to do? Combine items. Let's see what I have that I don't need. Uh, I probably have... Oh, I do have berries. So, so, so far, berries, other items, and treasures. So, hmm, treasures. I got some big mushrooms. I got nuggets. I don't even know. Are nuggets only for selling? Okay, this is risky, but I have some nuggets. They can be sold at a high... These these seem to just be sellable. So let me put in four nuggets. and just, I'm just curious what will happen. You have to save real quick. Okay, sure. So who knows what the nuggets are going to be You know, worth, what's going to happen. Combination process complete. A big nugget. Okay, so okay. Okay, okay, that's interesting. So I put in uh, four nuggets, got a big nugget. Uh, let's try something else really quick. And then, man, if I could get one more big nugget, that'd be awesome. But I'm looking for four of an item. Now, does it have to be the same item? There's a bomb mushroom. Uh, it can be sold at high prices. Again, I don't know, big mushroom. Let's try, let's try uh, popular with a certain class of collectors. I don't know, man. Tiny mushroom. I don't know, man. Let's do the bomb mushroom. There we go. There's four of those. Yes. Let's see what it gets me. Save and then it'll, that way it'll, it'll be good. Here we go. What are you going to give me? A pearl string. What is that? Let's take a look at what the pearl string is. I don't even know. But it's in my treasures. I already have them, I guess. Okay, very large pearl, pearls. High price. Huh. Okay. Pretty feather. I don't even know, man. But anyway, uh, that was interesting. It seems to turn like treasures into better treasures. So is he just playing a game? What is he, what is he doing? The first trial is to chase down the three fast slowpoke. And while you're at it, it would be cool if you could get back... Give back, yeah, I know the dojo uniform they stole. I'm gonna check out this room too. Is it what would you like to do? Nothing, restoring Pokemon just in case. All right, well, this has been a good introduction uh, to this. The way they move, those aren't ordinary slowpoke. Maybe they wanted to wear the dojo uniform. <laughs> yeah, maybe. What's in here? A kitchen, those are like some smart fridges over there. All right, so. This has been a good intro to the Isle of Armor DLC for Pokemon Sword and Shield. And what I'm going to do is next episode, go chase down the Slowpoke, figure out what needs to happen. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to come back next time for more. Be sure to like this video if you want to see more as quickly as possible because uh, this week is, is pretty busy for me. But I'm going to try whatever you guys want to see most. I'm going to make episodes of it. So if you want to see more Pokemon Sword, uh, specifically this DLC, of course, be sure to click that like button and then come back next time. For more, I'll see you then. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop.